Let me tell you about my hometown. Five years old, man. I went, you know, a lot of kids will say they want to be a ball player, they want to be a fireman or whatever. I wanted to be Kenny Rogers when I was growing up. I mean, that's that's what it was. That's exactly what I was going to be. But, you know, as life goes along, things change. and but That's always been a part of everything that I've ever done. You know, it's always been there. I've either written songs when I was at Cook or started this band when I was at Cook. You know, and so that part is always, it's never left me. And I just got to the point where I thought, if I don't do this, my last dying breath, I'm going to curse myself. And so, you know, that was the, it was a tough decision leaving Cook. Because, you know, I just knew I'd hate myself if I didn't try this. So I love Cook. And one of these days, maybe I'll go back to Cook. But uh, i got to try this, or I'll never be satisfied with myself. Around here is a simple life. Ain't got too far, but I'm doing all right. In love, I believe, and for freedom, I'll fight. I'm still living a simple life. I'm happy. I mean, this song is about Indiana. It's about Petersburg, Indiana. Uh, even Bloomington. I've, I've lived most of my adult life here, but when I wrote that song, I was thinking back in retrospect of where I grew up. I mean, my hometown was 3,000 people, two stoplights and IGA. I mean, that's listed. I mean, it's, it's a lyric in the song. You know, it's, it's a real special song for me, and it has that sort of Indiana sound that I, you know, I, I really dig. It's a fresh sort of thing in country now, and we're picking up fans from all over the country, which is interesting you know because they they dig what we're doing they dig the music which is really neat and people will say my my daughter won't go to bed unless i play the video you know she asks for it constantly and she won't go to bed at night until she sees the video and i'm thinking wow that's crazy you know that's nuts but that's cool you stop lights in an ig yeah. a little park where the children play Place where people mean what to say, say it right to your face. And lots of friends up and moved away. They couldn't find any reason to stay, but they still come back every holiday. Must be something about this place. Up at FMS. It was set up to where people won the opportunity to stand in line and get your autograph. And there were there were 50 people that won something to have me sign an autograph, and they were trembling. And I have no idea why. I mean, I'm just from down the street. I don't understand why they, you know, I don't get that. So they sit at a table, and people scoot their stuff across the table, and you sign it. And I got there, and I scooted the table out of the way, and I was like, bring it on. You know, if you want to hug me, hug me. If you want to, you know... Grab my butt, what do whatever you know, I'll sign whatever you want, I'll stand here as long as you want, and you know, this is not gonna be like anybody else. I, I don't want it to be like that's so removed. That's what's happening in country music. And I don't like that. I don't get it. Like people won't even do meet and greets anymore. I don't understand why. That's a part that's what makes country so great is because it's real. Around here is a simple life. Ain't got too far, but I'm doing all never satisfied so I don't know if I'll ever be satisfied with this I mean I I don't need to be Kenny Chesney I don't need to be a superstar that's never that was never it I like running a project and seeing that I can make it a success I just want to do something that's a success you know I can hang my hat on that and it'll be more fulfilling doing it my way too you know and getting it getting it there in my do-it-yourself sort of manner hillbilly i mean i'm i'm a farm kid you know and we learn how to do everything ourselves if i can pull this off by myself there's nothing that i can't do uh, you know i i feel that way maybe maybe i'm being a little cocky but you know that's the way i feel because if i can walk in as you know as a layman and turn this thing around and actually make it a success then i don't know that there's nothing that i set my mind to that i couldn't do